a close look at the pandemic-related rules in place for fans. Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Vince Levergine joins us live from the Coliseum with that part of our team coverage tonight. Vince? Tom, Linda, the Coliseum is pretty quiet right now, as you can tell. No fans are in the stands right now because the game just concluded and now workers are cleaning up after tonight's game. Just a few hours ago, there were many fans in the stands. It was at capacity, of course, under COVID guidelines. Now, as fans walked through the doors, it wasn't as business as usual. There were many restrictions. Fans had to wear masks. Now, that's a rule. Fans who buy tickets together sit in isolated group called pods. The idea is to space people far enough apart to reduce the potential spread of the virus. And there is lots of hand sanitizer. There are changes for players and staff, too. They have their temperatures checked. All of that aside, the fans I spoke to still had a good time, and they're so happy that Comet Hockey is back. It means the world. We love coming to the games. It's something that he's got into recently that I did a lot when I was a child with my parents, and I have a big love for the Comets, and the fact that he likes being here is very important to me. What's that excitement like when you see one of your favorite players score a goal? Tell me about that. It's really fun because that means that Fort Wayne's game goes against the other team. So that really excites me. Now that family you just heard from, Sean was telling me his son Tyler is nine and he's so happy that he could bring the tradition to Tyler and hopefully have him go to many future games just like Sean did over the years. Now I heard many people screaming with excitement as they walked to their seats. Now I should tell you something also that you should know. If you do bring it back to the game, make sure it's clear. That's for all Comet home games. Now for the Comets, they are back in action Saturday and Sunday right here at home. Reporting live in the Allen County War Memorial Coliseum, Vince Levergine, Fort Wayne's NBC. I know the sports guy and Vince wants to go ahead and give those highlights right now, but we'll have to wait just a little <laughs> bit uh, for Chris Ryan coming up later. Thank you, Vince.